high. Um, I'm not I was saying is I'm not so sure how much more I can do with these because there's not much left and it's starting to mat up a lot. The one that the knot in the back just seems like really stuck. And there it comes. I had a feeling that would happen. I think I'm losing that whole piece. So first, I think I'm, I like my little hat dealio, but um, this is now <coughs> what I got, and I know that it's ridiculous, like, ridiculous that I'm even attempting to um, brush this, but I started it, so... I want to finish it. And what happens, this matted part is the hair that's still stuck on your head getting caught up with the hair that's fallen. But now, <laughs> really? <laughs> it's just finishing what you started. And it's emotionally doesn't really affect me anymore. Okay, so <laughs> this thing is basically done. I think if I even try to brush it, all that's going. Look, that's crazy. Nothing holding it on. A very stylish hairdo. Don't you want this look? <laughs> I, I have a feeling this is the last time because this looks like. I mean, honestly, I can't even do this. Like, I can't stop touching my head. It's <laughs> such a weird feeling. But whatever. I'm a weirdo. Um, I'm really glad that I was able to film all this. And I hope it helps people not be so scared going through it. It's a process, but it's a process that you want to happen because that means the drugs are working. And yeah, eventually I'd love to do one of those like cool like morphing videos showing that your hair all that kind of like growing back in stages. <laughs> but for now I'm focusing on just making sure that this chemo kicks its butt, this cancer butt. And um, thank you for watching. And that's it. This is me, right? <laughs>